What's up, guys? I don't think I had time to even say anything. Okay, so the tornado is here. Yes, of course, I've already. Well, I haven't really played much of Life is Strange 1 beforehand. I've only played just the beginning. But yeah. Huge tornado over there. I'm trying to make it to the lighthouse over here. Up there. Uh, it's gonna be nice actually for replaying this instead of just watching like six playthroughs from many different people. Because when I first played it, I just played, like, the beginning, that's it. Uh... Keep going. Alright. Holy shit. So surreal. Famously called film Little Pieces of Time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm so in class. Everything's cool. I'm sorrow. okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't and white? fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diana yeah, you Arbus. just looked at the future. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faith. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. He says, you feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, shh, shh. Keep that thing. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I guess I will uh, say you're asking me? You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. <laughs> Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a Shut up. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. <laughs> the Daguerrean process brought out fine details hold up, hold faces, up, hold up. making them okay, extremely something. popular from the 1800s. <laughs> but Bob's just so quick. Cornelius. All right. You can find out all Got about it them back. in your textbook. Or so I'll read this. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Hey, I mean, you could pause to read this. I'm not actually reading it. <laughs> I really ain't. I really ain't. 
Okay, but I guess press all I be here. Okay, Victoria. Okay, that's her name. And then I know about Kate. Okay. All right. Read this messages. You could pause. <laughs> Happy birthday, Nancy. Okay. Then there's Warren. <laughs> she just left him on red. <laughs> Online. Thirty. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. How'd you know? All right, now we get to walk around. Tablet, we're gonna use that. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Honestly, don't care. I guess let's uh look at this. Her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she? Fifteen years old? And people laughed. I just really think you use but. No, let's speak to Kate. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. By putting yourself out there in the world. Kate, I hope I didn't embarrass you with my lame answer. It sucks to be dragged into the spotlight. Unless you're Victoria. She's got nothing on you, Max. Well, I should get going. Yeah, me too. Talk to you later. Sure. Okay. Alright. So, uh, go ahead and start moving. Photo. Take a photo of that. We gotta make sure we take these photos. It's not because I want the achievements, it's because we need to actually take the photos. Because obviously I'll go back and replay this. I'm not looking at that. I'm not looking at Victoria. No, I'm looking at TV. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I forgot this app. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Shut now, up. I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. You know, I don't That's ever trust you, because I already know what happens. Mr. Jefferson trying to shoot. Yes, I don't want to spoil. <laughs> I probably just spoiled it myself, actually, just to make it, I just now remember that. I was about to. Uh, oh, you sure welcome to the real world? <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash yeah. water on my face and make but some sure school I don't shooter. Like total loser. All right. It's way Enix. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a giant camera. To all of you American girls, it's sad to imagine a world. I love that picture of mom and dad. Hello, Jack. American kiss, kiss. Girls, Andy, you look like totally you. fabulous as usual. Be part of the world around you. 
I pray there's no copyright, I don't really know. Of course I don't know. Let's go ahead and check if there's anything here. I ain't gonna bother with those things. <laughs> yeah, it said things. But the video's already 13 minutes long. <laughs> Missing person. Oh, Rachel. Yeah, we'll see you all the crap about that and before the storms. Which I'm definitely doing. I mean, I could have actually done that very silly. Because that's before this. Bathroom in here. Women. Hear that. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. Ha. Ha ha. Wait. So this is where it is. Use that. Before we do anything, we gotta quickly make sure there's nothing in here, because I only know what happens. Of course. School shooter comes in here. <laughs> That's why I love this game. <laughs> Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. She tries to take a picture of that. Closes, mm -hmm. A window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. The guy was that short. Let's take a photo. Mm. Gotcha. Okay. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. These pieces of time can frame us I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color to now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Oh, now, shit. Can you give me an example of Man, a photographer? I cannot believe who this. Captured the human condition in black and white. All right. Okay, if I'm crazy, let's rewind. I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Oh, let's see. Why are we? Because of her. Yeah, I'm trying to. All right, here we go. I did it. Can you give me I actually did it. <laughs> perfectly oh, Max. The Max we know. Anybody? Trying to move my Max, don't freak out. Don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. 
Why Arvis? Because of her Keep images it together, of Max. Spaces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of when those... When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not of dreaming course, this. As you all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie <laughs> expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me you after class. And I need time to save that girl. Types? A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapter. Oh, in the way. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you Why are not? crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Yes, Victoria, okay. you still have to do your homework. Hello. Yeah, you still have to do your homework this week. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody in class is turning in a photo. Excuse Hi. me. Uh, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Sorry, that with my, uh, oh, I messed up. Uh, okay. Need to go right there. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody in class is turning in a photo, so... You see the I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just work so hard in the shot, and I'm Books sure over here, okay. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't Shut even up. think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I will rip you out. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Yo, Daniel. 
You remember that it's payday? You know I don't tease. Oh, no, I hate that science class. I know you didn't forget you owe us cash. <laughs> because I'm if you send sure. me a picture, I won't be bored. You soft kids. Here we go again. So we trace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down! Tell me what to do. I I'm need so a hammer to break it open. People trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Screw it up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Screw it up really bad right there. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hell Just hammer. trouble for this. Oh, we already have it. Would, oh. Miss your punk ass, would they? <laughs> oh, <boy. laughs> Don't ever touch me again, freak. Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. <laughs> I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. Yeah. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, I can tell you that boy got a gun. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Hold on, Max. Come back here. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott? You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns... Yeah, that's the thing. Sad that uh, there's gonna be consequences. That's the part that's, uh... Gonna be crazy, really. Blackwell Academy. I forgot what the school is even called. <laughs> forgot. Really did. So. Would Nathan Prescott
I actually don't look that bad. Rachel Amber. Crash. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. We'll find out pretty soon and before the storm. <laughs> yeah, Chloe's friend. I, I'm pretty sure that was her name. The girl with the blue hair. Yeah, we'll find out what happened with Rachel. We're playing as Chloe. I'm not sitting on the fountain, dude. I better read Warren's text before he blows my phone up. Oh my god. Uh, I'm asking you my pleasure. I need some info in space. Hello. Sorry, running away. Insane day. I'll meet you in the lot. Looking cool, you'll see. My camera will be ready. See you shortly. I hope so. Okay. Okay, nope. I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. So we gotta go in and get that flash drive back. Go to my room and get his flash drive. Okay, so we gotta... Gotta go to the dorm. Gotta go to the girls' dorm. Dormitory. Yeah, go. I like the remastered, kinda, so far. See, as you can see, the emotion a lot better, mainly, which is good. This first one, well, well, the original. You can't really see much emotion, but they, it was there, that's for sure. Alright. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Oh, not these things. They're guarding it. They're guarding it. I got an idea. So what? We already know what we gotta do here. We gotta speak oh, to her and see what it's she's gonna say. The selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Looks like Miley Cyrus. <laughs> Back around like when she did was in that twenty thirty song. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your I barely mental. realize that. I mean, now, I wouldn't say that she looks like, but still. Beforehand. You know all the answers. I guess you have to find another like 2013. way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. It's a hater. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social now media. Now, vintage now. Uh, I'll put a vintage uh, little oh, yes, Victoria. thing I'll on it so I can uh, make sure it looks even better. I will make sure all the board can be seen though. That's Keep the walking, thing. Hidden. Keep talking. Keep talking. Alright then. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. Sorry, no paparazzi allowed. Paparazzi. There goes Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. Oh, hold up. Let's go and rewind just a bit. Okay, never mind. We can't actually do it. I was about to say, what happened? I could paint the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Okay, let's see if this works. Poor Samuel. <laughs> no. Poor, poor Samuel. Well, wait for him to get up. Not gonna skip anything, really. Video's always more than like 30 minutes long. My god. Here we go. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right under the bucket. What the hell? Thanks so much. For Keep walking, hippie. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right under the bucket. Oh. 
None shall pass. Capiche? Okay, let's see if this works. Keep walking, hippie. Victoria is not getting the hint. Yeah. I can't really tell because I'm not the best at this hint. By the way, I've been always trying to sometimes hide my webcam when there's like important scenes early. Thing is, it's not in the way it should be. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right. Yeah, I know they got to, Max. I, I get it. So hold up. I'm gonna probably skip through just a tadge bit, just a tadge. Pretty sure you gotta go in there, mess with the spring boys. Alright, so hold up, hold up, hold up. Tamper, tamper, tamper. Hurry up, hurry up. Come on! Okay, let's see if this works. No, we've already done the. Oh, crap. Now we gotta go back to where we first did it. Oh. Use, use, use! I, I screwed myself over. Really. Really. <laughs> yes, we got her. We got her. Okay, let's see. Now look at me, works. idiot. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Come on, Samuel. I feel bad for this dude. These little spoiled brats over there. No way. No <laughs> oh, Samuel, sorry. That's good seeing that. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. <laughs> yeah, don't. <laughs> All right, now we're gonna speak. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I, I don't want to be rude, to be honest. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there will be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel yeah. before they hang a sign on me. Dude. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck your selfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, <laughs> no, you I'm gonna pull exactly the trigger when I get it done. Trio. Aim at you. I'll see you later. I'll make sure we right, blood well. spotted everywhere. Okay. I didn't want to be rude, to be honest. Because, well, it will have consequences, of course. Every choice we choose again. We gotta choose wisely. Uh. Okay, bye bye, my God. Courtney. Really, Courtney? Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Yeah, I know. Toilet paper everywhere. Is this my- Oh uh, no, this is the bathroom. But, I- How would I not realize? Going into this room. Little room here. 
You need a bigger teddy bear than that. That is too little. My god. Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. <laughs> No, don't put it down. No, reverse that, reverse. <laughs> Bruh. Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer but I wait, what the did she know? Idiot. Oh my god. What all did she know, though? It's Chloe. That she saved. Which is the part that is funny, but of course. So we. Yeah, we've opened the joy, apparently. Right? I am so addicted to this site. Look at these I was about to say. <laughs> I was about to say. I don't see it. it. It could be in this. Yo! Let me get to this! It's hard to believe I'm 18 now. Not I'm not looking at this. Enabled my photo habit into adulthood. I only ain't. All right, note. Mirror. We could let's take a photo. And make sure we get as many photos as we can. That we missed one already though. Possibly. Obviously I'll go back, but that's the thing about it. Books photos. Sticky note. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Dana's room. Oh, now I gotta kill Dana. Well, I'm about to... I'm... You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me really? the are rotten there. Bah. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. How stupid. Hey, Juliet. Drama queens. Is everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. You are ridiculous. What did she do? What didn't she do? <laughs> Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. <laughs> Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Uh, I know it's none of these. It has to be like Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Of course uh, I do. Just because I don't talk a lot, I didn't know. I don't care. So how did you find out about them? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date <laughs> a quarterback. According to Victoria, huh? She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything. But I bet Victoria did. So... More people we've seen. Alright. We need proof that Dana is innocent. Proof is... Let's leave this. I no. Okay, never mind. I thought we had to do something. Oh, oh, hold up. We gotta probably go in, the, in here. Oh, no, we can't. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try to save some time here. So I don't, I mean, I'm sure you wanna see, like, the whole entire thing. But I'm gonna, it'll take a while for me to find. Oh, no, never mind. Victoria's room is here. I, I'm, I was kind of confused for a moment. Uh, let's go ahead and check. Laptop, laptop, I know it's in here. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice shot. Okay, if I did wear expensive jewelry, I would wear this for sure. No, I wouldn't. Well, I know I'm not a girl, but... I mean... I bet Victoria put Juliet on her shit list after this article. Shoes, TV... Ouch. Well, at least she puts her photographs out there. Hey, right, it's happily. Oh, it's definitely on there. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. Huh. Well, I'm gonna get to where I find it. 
Photo Tetris and leave Victoria. Ha ha ha! Tetris. Let's move this here, and this one there. Yes, sir. Hmm, a pattern is emerging. Okay, ne never mind. Um, it'll have consequences, so I don't want to mess. I, I'm, I'm gonna be it. I ain't doing it. Is it even in here? Okay, I don't know. I don't know. Show Juliet. Oh, I didn't know you had to do this. Get the hell out of here. I didn't know we could just swipe <laughs> like that, but I didn't know. Wait, can we actually explode down when I go? Boom! This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Print email, obviously. We gotta quickly get it though. Cause uh she's gonna be crying like a little baby. This better convince Juliet Typical. that Dana is innocent. Oh, we're about to get caught. No? Okay, okay, okay. Email. Here's the email, stupid this. idiot. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Now, try. <laughs> Almost done. Okay, that was so like unnecessary. I kind of uh, I can't. Pregnancy. <laughs> Protect my brain. Is she pregnant so though? I need to see. To be honest, it. I kind of see. <laughs> That looks like a home pregnancy test. Yeah. I'm... No. Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. <laughs> You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Bah. I didn't mean to. What's up? hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up to her. I'm gone. All right. One. Okay. I don't mind waiting out here forever. I love this walking while I can count all the cards. The more I text, the longer it takes. I'm on my way. The longer I take. I'm on my way. Bye. Okay. Yeah. Bye. And I hope you, uh, and the DA eats it. <laughs> yep. Here we go. I don't remember how long each episode was. I think it was like two hours. So there may be like five episodes. Fuck this shit. Oh. Ow. That hurt. Damn. I better rewind. This shit. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Finally. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, little boy. That's what you get. That's what you get, buddy. Yeah, but at the same time, uh... Oh. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Black. What? Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. You can't fool me. I know I'm I nine to me. School. I need this photo. I cover the waterfront, so you better figure out what side you're on. Please leave me alone. But this is the reason why she was suicidal. Hope you enjoyed the show. 
Thanks for nothing, Max. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. You know what? Let's do it then. Let's do it. I could rewind and try something different. Hey, right, now we got it. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? All right. No, and leave me alone. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us. This is official campus business. Excuse us. <laughs> you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. Yeah, no, why? duh. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. But I'm about to turn you into freaking uh, hot dogs. Oh, Max, that was great. Yeah. I think you scared him for once. I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. Well, shall I say I'll turn him into bugs? Because like he's me. Well, I'm clear if he's after me, but at the same time. I want to make sure Kate is alright on my side. Because realizing she won't be on my side is the problem. Alright. I love this game so far. And this is already a long video. This is probably one of the longest ones I've had in a while. Since about the Halo Infinite video, but it's not the longest. Alright. Here we go. School shooters gonna come around too. Oh, one. I thought there was gonna be a cutscene. Oh, I keep forgetting everything. Watch so many playthroughs of this game. Played it only a few times. I just keep on forgetting. Oh, how? Well. Here's what the up, flash drive, you. How are you? Here's your flash. You piece Thanks. of crap. No problem. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. And crappy. to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? No, I've been way too busy with class and life. Damn, girl, you had it like a year. Or a week. I did browse through all the titles, Drama Queen. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. No fucking way will I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. I don't want to speak about it. This is kind of a crazy day for me. I mean, I literally think I'm going crazy. I may be a pest, but I'm a good listener. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal, now. Answer me, bitch! I told him the truth. A student had a gun. No, you told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged me into his office. And did what? Give you a stern lecture? Nobody. Nobody lectures me. Everyone tries, though. <laughs> they try. 
You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh, man. You're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! Hey! Leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore Leave in the down. bathroom! <gasps> Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Warren! Go! Go! I got this! Get in, Max! Get your punk asses out of there now! Don't even try to run! Nobody! Nobody! Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? No, it felt like a real city for artists. Big and bright. Great for taking pictures. Yeah, must be hard coming back to a hick town like Arcadia again. Not after seeing you. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course, it's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. I'm sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Broken? Oh, man, are you serial? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it in my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. Come on in, don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home. My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate.
Who'd have thought Chloe wouldn't pay her parking tickets? She does love trouble. I think this junk swallowed her discs. Look at that. Chloe and her dad were so close. We had such a blast drawing these together. Dude, you broke my glass snow dough. Thanks. It reeks like dirty laundry. Gross. Chloe totally changed yeah. her style. I barely recognized her. Yeah, no doubt she dyed her hair blue. Look. Chloe was always taller than me. We made her dad keep track of her height. Uh. I need to kind of uh, find this. I think it's right here. Oh yeah, it is. Oh my god, I wish I realized that. This video is like an hour more long. So realize that. Hey, give me that. Sorry, I wasn't trying to be nosy. Obviously, oh my she's god. a good friend. It's putting it mildly. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Yeah, I put them up. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Rachel saved my life. Man, I had no idea. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. I never forgot. Even if I was an asshole and didn't keep in touch. But you had Rachel. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. You would laugh at how different we were. She wanted to be a star. She looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. What about your mom? What did Joyce think about all this? She can not wait to get rehitched. Step dick is one reason I wanted to bail. I feel the love. Now, when did Rachel actually disappear? Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. I believe you. I'm just trying to get all deductive. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. Then poof. And you haven't heard anything from her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you, and Rachel. Gone. Can you put on some music now? Yes. Why can't I do that the first time? Why can't I always skip all that dialogue, man? I mean, that's the whole point of this game, no way, but, uh... Yeah, I'll put some music on. When I could find your speaker. I is this it? Hi-Fi here? It won't, it won't let me do anything. It won't play without any power. There's no power. You can't... Oh. Oh, yeah, my bad, man. I was wondering... Oh, but I'm about to get so copyrighted. Oh my god, but I'm gonna have to turn off the audio, to be honest with you. 
I'm gonna. I gotta save myself from the copyright. Just in case. I don't know. Anyway, yeah, I need to start saving myself. You can myself. find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe. So we do lock okay? out. Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. Okay. Whatever. I would never want to be in this room again. Well, we have to do a loading transition between the scraps. Stupid to me. Really? I mean, I guess it's fine, but not not the finest. The right here. Someone from the other side. What episode are we on? Are we still on one. I think I we still are. This place in five years. Seems like forever. Yeah, it looks like crap. It's a couch, I'm not sitting on it. So right now I shouldn't sit I should right now. Find the, tools I need here. find the tools I need in here. Oh, I didn't know. I was about to say. Maybe it's looking the cupboard. The tools might be in this cupboard. Um, no, it's just snacks. What about this? Let's, let's just search this. These are way too big. I need. Yeah, they have to have a tiny one. <laughs> Back that really thought. I'm not switching this on. Unless, oh no, 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 I'm not opening that door. I'm not gonna open that door. Don't do it. What the? Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For real? This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe oh, and yeah, know but... about this? I don't ever seen the backyard boy. I mean, I'm fine with the outside. <laughs> of course. I'm gonna skip. Hold up. That father is this asshole hmm. from Blackwell? You've gotta be shitting me. Yeah. Chloe's so, stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school? How paranoid can you get? I don't know. And the tools should be in here. It's over here. Nothing. But... This is so lame. Bro, where does he have it? Alright, yeah, alright, guys. Done that before the think, call. think I. Okay, so now we know what to do. I, I did not realize that it was on top of there the whole time. Now let's go back there. Come on, I'm holding on to make it go faster. God. I was pushed this already. Now, bang. Why is it on top of there, though? Is my question. Like, why was it there? Of all places you could put that, you put it there. Yes, you have mad skills, man. No, we don't. We rewind all the time. <laughs> I've got the tools. And we're screwing up the up little time. Chloe freaks. 
go upstairs. Just make sure my car's been a while. Well done. Oh. Uh, usually I'm mute, but I'm dead. Whatever. Long way. I'm pretty sure. Is it this one? It is. Bruh! Uh, here we go. So, I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah, I just took them today. Let me see. seen this before uh no way when did you take this you took this photo you brat in the bathroom today you set off the alarm that's why nathan raged after you it totally makes sense you hella saved my life now tell me the truth max i was there hiding in the corner damn you're a ninja a ninja would have cut nathan's head off i just took a butterfly photo that is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? I wasn't sure. I know I look a lot different. I was scared too, I, I couldn't see straight. I don't blame you, Max. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? Like who? Like anybody. Stop stalling, sister. The principal. But he didn't seem to believe me. The principal? Are you still 12? That drunk jackass only cares about cash for Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. I didn't mention you at all. Swear. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. Oh, no, no! The copyright! No, I think it's copyright. I, uh, okay. No, it was your birthday last Oh, month. never mind. I, I thought you got to turn on the music. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. That's so cool you remembered my birthday, but I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash- Copyright. Can't do it. Sorry guys, but uh, I'll just skip to just some, but I'm not keeping the music on. And yes, they're dancing. <laughs> Taking a photo. But. Dude, the music's not even on! I, I went ahead and... Oh, no fucking way. Exit. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Chloe, what's going on? Open this door, please. Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide now. <sighs> Chloe, I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just let me in now. <laughs> Chloe, I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, this is going nowhere I'm fast. Changing. I better look someplace else. I'm what coming. Are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just let me in now. Please. One second. My bra is stuck. I'm not screwing around, soldier. Chloe, open this door. Shit. What's going on in here? 
Jesus, I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' paranoid. Yeah, combat, we'll do that to you. One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh, God, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh, yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. Whose is it? Stop treating me and my mom like we're your family platoon. Hey, leave Joyce out of this. I wish you'd leave Joyce, like now. Chloe, I'm sorry. I care about your mother and you just keep pushing me. Don't touch me again, asshole. That's the last time. Or I'll bring the cops in here so fast. You're not that dumb. I'd be smart to have you busted. Chloe, someday you'll grow up. Hey, you okay? Welcome to the real step douches of Arcadia Bay. I'm sorry. For what? He would have been a bigger dick if he caught you in here. That's hard to believe. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can go to in this hick hole. David was such a mean bastard to Chloe. Yeah, it is. I haven't been here in forever, so why do I feel like I was just here? Whoa, this is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today. Huh, wait a second, I'm confused. Did we just go here? Or did... Birds are so lucky, they can always escape. Yeah, no duh. Oh, never mind. I'm taking a photo. <laughs> Not missing one chance of getting a photo. Well, I've only missed like two or three, but whatever. You sure you don't want to be alone? Sit down if you want. She's definitely mad at Are us. You pissed at me? I just. Wanted some backup. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. He freaked out on poor Kate Marsh today. I know her. She's cool. Only that prick would bully her. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? You know, I wanted to, but I realized I have enough mystery in my life. I'd like to find out. I bet he's got some serious porn in there. Ugh. Good thing you didn't look. He's a total surveillance fetish. I worry there's spy cams in the house. I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. I knew it. He's so hella fucking paranoid. I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. Even yours? Not anymore. So what do you have on Nathan? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. 
What? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted, and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. How much do you owe? Three grand plus interest. And before I could get a chunk of that from Nathan, he dosed my drink with some shit. God, Chloe. I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. Chloe, that is so fucked up. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. He's still dangerous, Chloe. Not just to you. Oh, good thing you notified the principal. I feel safer already. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. Why is it Boyd like that? It's so Boyd! It just really got bullied like that. Sorry guys, but you have to deal with if that. This is Destiny. I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. Holy crap, this girl is horrible. It ain't my Shit fault, it's really not. Like, it's loved. like this on my TV, too. Like to drop for some reason. It's just the game. They really should have done something bad with this remaster. <laughs> I like it, but. Oh no, she's getting it. Oh no! Not again! This time Why is worse. Is well, it's I happening like for a good and bad reason. You messed up the time thing, so Yeah. I mean, it's not even her fault that she did. She randomly oh, found no, out there. about this. I have to find out. You gotta be happy if you got this power. Oh, little guy, I'll befall you and sniff the butt. Cause I'm a weirdo. I'm following, don't worry. Oh, but that's a huge tornado. Oh my lord! The tornado is back! That's the part about it, too. Read. October 11th? Is this Friday? That's only four days away! Oh, no. Yep, it's a water tornado, too. That Help. tornado is headed straight for the town. So, yeah. Pretty much. But why is the quality looking so bad when we switch back to this scene? That's so stupid. Totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. 
Morgan gets about 520 news every 20 years. We just don't. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But I, right? Listen to me. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. People don't have those powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. What the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. I don't know what's wrong with the quality right now, bro. It's like it was so good that the storm came, but it's like when it comes to this, it's just not good. Hold up, I'm gonna see if I can do something about that. Me, me pause this real quick. It's just that it's horrible quality, at, like in that scene. Everything else is just like fine. Just bad quality.